All right, so I've split the part. We're gonna continue on. I'm really upset. I want to fight these, kill it. these frogs. I feel like I can do it. And uh, to stay calm. it's pretty sad. But what am I doing, right? I'm sad because I know this is exactly Crucible Night. This is exactly the same for me. I get addicted to it. I know I'm getting better at it. I know I can do it. It's not unbeatable. It's just annoying as fuck. So then I get addicted to fighting the fucking thing, right? And it's like, I just want to beat it. I just got to beat the frogs. Do there, he jumped behind me, and there was no opportunity to block or dodge. I don't know what to do to that. I dodge it once, and then it hits me again, right? Thank you to Zero for becoming a channel member. That's a new channel membership today, too. By the way, guys, this is my only stream of the day, so I'd appreciate it if you could support it, regardless of the fact that I'm addicted to fighting frogs, and I can't stop myself. Looks like it's still I'd still here. appreciate it if you could support the stream. Yeah, Zero, I know. He says, I suggest wait. Everyone's saying just wait and fight them later, but you know me. I gotta do it. I gotta beat them now. I have to fucking beat them now. The question is, how do I dodge? When they get to this second form of this jumping bullshit, how do I even get out of the way? I dodge, it still hits me anyway. I can do. He does it point blank. He interrupts his own jumping animation to do it. He's not even on the ground yet. He interrupts his own animation to do it. And then as an unblockable, you can't dodge from that range. <clears throat> and my controller just vibrated. Late. That didn't work. Focus, Cal. Dodge, even though he's right there, should be able to. It doesn't work. I need something, buddy. Well, Michael just did a super chase. I think you're helping me avoid a purchase. I can say this looks fun. Can't say this looks fun. Best of luck. Yeah, I mean, and this is the high level gameplay. You understand the rest of the games, like the the this other stuff's easy. This is supposed to be like the challenging stuff in the game, the optional super challenge fight. And if it's made, it is poorly because it is. This is fucking pathetic. It's you know they're trying to emulate FromSoft and failing miserably. You know, it just sucks. Like they fucked it up so bad. This is the first major area of the game. Why? Why is this in the first major area? If this is supposed to be an end game thing, why is it here? Remember that time when you played Dark Souls and within the first uh, three, four hours, there's an end game boss? I remember that, right? What the fuck is that?
This is not a Souls-like game. Are you blind? That's exactly what this fight is. This is a Dark Souls fight or an Elden Ring fight. That's literally what this is to a T. That's exactly what they wanted to do. Waits until I do an animation, then does the unblockable, so I can't interrupt it. I hit the tongue. I hit the tip of the tongue. Did you see that? Get out of the way because I'm on the edge of the screen. You can't jump there. Yep. <clears throat> the echo is still here. So dumb. Calm. Stuck on the wall. Well, I didn't make the wall. I didn't make the jump. That's a, a shortcoming of the game developers. They fucked it up. doing is he was completely off screen. I don't know what to do to that attack. That's the one I haven't dodged yet. I don't know how to do it. Oh my god, he did a double unblockable. He did a charge, then he did a body splash. I don't know how to avoid the full screen jump. The full screen jump, he does a body splash. First you have to avoid the splash, then there's a giant area of an effect. So you have to dodge the splash, but then you can't do a double dodge to dodge the area of effect. I don't here. know how you're supposed to get away from it. Focus, Cal.
the double. If he does a double, you will always get hit by the second. Away from it, I can't believe it. Help me, this. God, he just kept doing non-stop unblockables. Like literally it was all unblockables at the end. Literally it was all fucking unblockables. It was unblockable, 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 unblockable. No openings, zero openings, zero, zero openings to hit the guy. <laughs> Gotta stay calm. The slow motion's worthless. All it does is let you get behind, get one hit, then they immediately can do unblockables again. The slow motion doesn't work, so I'm not using it. It doesn't do anything in this fight. Jumping just gets you anyway. Yep. No, I know I had him. I, I totally should have won. But you saw he did, he literally did a string of unblockables. A string of unblockables. That there was nothing missing. I could do about. I there was no opening there during any of those unblockables to attack. So I would have had to endlessly just keep dodging and and, and avoiding calm. until finally he was open. It was insane. The game decided that RNG sequence of events for the frog. <laughs> what? Oh, uh, I dodged it, landed, and it still hit me.
dunk that's stuck against the wall. You can't dodge. It's not my fault. It's the game controls are awful. And it, it fucks up the jump at the, at the wall. Like, what did, what did I do wrong? Why if I keep getting against the wall, then I can't move? There's not even a fucking wall there. It's an invisible fucking wall. Terrible game design. He does a double bite. His single bite, single bite. When I finally say, I'll take advantage, just double bite. He waited for me to attack to do the third bite. Are you shitting me? That is ridiculous. Now they're changing their patterns. They're literally changing their patterns now. They're doing like single bite, single bite. Oh, you're going to attack now? Unblockable. So you interrupt your fucking move. Like, fuck this. Spawn of Ogdo seems to attack way more. Maybe it does. I don't know. I'm really not paying attention. I'm just trying to focus on whatever's nearer to me. There's literally no way to dodge it unless you're far enough away to get out of the range of the tongue. You actually can't dodge it from up close. It's literally undodgeable from up close because he, he rotates and tracks you and then hits you from point blank. It's unbelievable. It's absolutely like it's unbelievable. That fucking attack is so bullshit. They fucked it up so bad. Can't jump over it. Do this. Faded. I guess that didn't work.
Another one go, here he is. As I was killing one, the other one does his unblockable and insta kills me. As I'm killing the one, the other one says, well, too bad. I've decided to end the fight so you start over. Literally no way to stop it. You will instantly die. Right? Unbelievable. That didn't do it. Unbelievable. You're killing one, you're in a death animation for one, my tongue goes through the dead body of my, my father and kills you. It's amazing gameplay. inadvertent. It's actually true, they said, uh, they spent all this money making the Death Star, they should have just made an army of these frogs. You're absolutely correct. With these controls and these frogs. <clears throat> Something's still wrong. <clears throat> I could do this.
Oh my god. He perfectly grabs me through the other one. <laughs> the echo's still here. I don't think that did it. Focus he purposely does that, gets his animation blocked. Oh my god. Ugh. Double unblockable. Hey. Once they get down to less than half health, they can do four bites in a row, in which case you have to block four times. But you don't you don't know. It looks exactly the same as the two bites. It looks literally exactly the fucking same as the two bites. The echo hasn't faded. I guess that didn't work. Yeah, I didn't realize that I, I had so little health. I had no idea. I thought that I had more health and I was going to absorb a bite. You can get bubbles after my next death. hit me for no reason.
four bites. I I pair. Are you kidding me? You gotta be kidding me. He kept attacking. Like there's nothing I could do. He kept fucking attacking. He does four bites. I'm parrying the last one. Let me heal now. No, I'm gonna do another attack. A fifth follow-up unblockable attack. It is so unfair. I don't think that worked. All right. At least I'm keeping my cool. At least I'm keeping my cool. But guys, this is my only stream for today. I've only got about an hour left. It would be great if you could support the stream in some way. I appreciate the likes. I appreciate the super chats and the tips that have come in so far. But being that I'm only doing this once today, it would be great if you could support it, alright? With an hour left. I'm doing my best. I've almost gotten this beat, right? I've almost gotten this beat. I just need to not be cheaped out, basically, by the I game. Do this. <clears throat> No, I'm not skipping the boss after spending two hours on it and getting down to the end. There's no way I'm quitting now. Nothing you can do. Point blank, instant death. Point blank, instant death. Never can get out of the way of it. The echo hasn't faded. I guess that didn't work. Focus. <sighs> There's literally, I was trying, I just wanted to see. There's no way to avoid it from point blank. The tongue is so broken with this insane hitbox it shouldn't have. You have to be away from it. You cannot be anywhere near the frog or you instantly die. There's no way around it. It's completely fucking broken. I couldn't do it. I can do this. Complete stupidity. Complete stupidity on the game designer's fault. And they should really fucking uh, be held to task and fix it. No, you shouldn't have a fucking move like that. It's insane. I dodged it. Did you see that? He jumped through the other one. 
Oh, he did a double unblockable again. Help me, BD. See, I have no healing left. He's gone. He decided he's interrupting his unblockables that shouldn't be interruptible. I have no health. I have zero health. Okay, I got it fucking done. That did the trick. And I get a skill point. That's it. One skill point. That's literally it. Right? One skill point. I received one skill point for killing both frogs at once. A singular fucking skill point. That was my fucking reward. One skill point. This will fetch a dumbest shot. One skill point is what I received. A single point. Better than a poncho? I would prefer the poncho. I received a $2 tip from DW. Congratulations. You might as well have beaten the hardest, most BS thing in the game. Smooth sailing from here on in. And let me tell you, let me tell you guys something. I'm going to get something good with this fucking skill point. I don't know what I'm getting, but it's better be fucking great. Whatever I get better be amazing. The best ability in the game, right? Kagome says I have an anger problem. I'm actually not even, <laughs> I'm not angry. I'm relieved I beat it. I'm pretty relieved. So here's the save point, which we've already been to. Oh, by the way. Yes. So we get all these the new seeds when we see those bugs in the environment. We have to remember to attack the bugs. And you get seeds. Now I know that. I didn't know that when I was previously here. So here's the save point. <sighs> okay. I have one skill point. <laughs> what should I put it into? A focused parry, perform a spinning strike on releasing Y, and precision release. Dual wielding, hold X to deal fast strikes toward a single enemy. Survival. Uh, Kel's li maximum life is increased. I think we should just do that. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do more health. Sounds like a plan. Oh, I'm doing the story now. It's exactly where I'm going. I've had enough of that bullshit. 
I'm not doing any more optional stuff now. You're out of your mind. I'm going right to the Let's story. Go. So, how do we get across here? Because it's up there, right? Where we've already been. You got to do the wall run to get over there. Because I don't think we opened the shortcut, did we? I don't think so. The shortcut only goes one way, right? Like, I can't jump on this. Oh, you can jump on it. I'll go up. Holy shit. I didn't even know that. All right. Frame rate is absolutely terrible right now. So now this opens. Yup. It didn't open before, but now it opens for the story. Here we go. The forest gate. Okay. I received a $5 tip from Sean H. Here is five skill dollars for your skill point. Thanks for the entertainment this weekend. You're welcome, Sean. I told you I guys would do it. I told you I would. I knew it was going to take a million years, but I told you I would beat that shit. Now I don't have to fucking do that. I'm done with it. I don't have to go back to it. I got my skill point. Oh boy. My one skill point. For fighting two fucking bosses at once. Right? Oh my god. The array should be out here somewhere. The only way forward is to come through. You catch that drone. Not alone out here. Looks like it's blocked. Sit tight, BD. Let me see what I can do. Wait, what happened? Didn't work? It's blocked. It's no use, BD. What the fuck do I do? Wall run. Okay. Bring some little ones too. I don't know what those do. If anything. Oh, hit me in the head. Did you see that? <laughs> Let's take this it clobbered me in the head. Alright. Hey, seeds. We should try planting these back in the garden. A new a new seed type. Good to go, BD. Let's try that again. Cool. Oh, what the shit? So you guys think with the frog, were the frogs worth it? Oh, you can't go this way. Oh, come on, really? Yes, I can. Look at this. Yes, I can. I can go wherever I want. Look what I just found. Where are we going right now? This is an optional area. What do you think this array is, buddy? Maybe it's not. Maybe this is where we're supposed to go. Z seems to think so too. Only one way to find out. Maybe this was where we were supposed to go. Empire. I don't think they saw us. Let's move. Oh, is there a a ship? Look at that. Cool view. Cool view. The frogs weren't worth it, but it was fun seeing you overcome the struggle. Says Darren. I'm glad. I'm glad you guys got entertainment out of it. Obviously, when something like that happens, I, I feel. I do, I feel like this weird challenge feeling, like what it was with the uh, the Tree Sentinel in Elden Ring, and then later on it was the Crucible Knight in Elden Ring, where I felt like I absolutely needed to beat it. I don't know what it is about me that sometimes that happens. Oh shit, wait a minute. Oh, okay. Sometimes that happens, I just can't stop myself. And you know what? I got it done, so fuck it, it's over now. We don't have to worry about it in the future. It's, you know, I got my single skill point, whoopity fucking doopity. Now think about this. Should that not have been a much better reward? Shouldn't have been like five skill points or something like a good worthy reward for fighting one of the hardest fights in the game? Why fucking give you a meager, meager crappy reward? Again, it's like the game devs don't know what the fuck they're doing. 
Why do that? It's just a, it feels like a slap in the fucking face. Don't like the, amps the thing is, I wasn't expecting anything because I if the game was already that screwed up, then you know that they're also not going to reward you properly, right? Looks like we do this from the other side. didn't do much so if we get across that's how I'm gonna make the shortcut back we got to get across first which we haven't done they give you invincibility for beating champion bog deer <laughs> this will be fought later when it's easier so the skill point is justified then it shouldn't be in this part of the game it should be later you understand that if you're gonna put something in your game and it's so ridiculously difficult you have to make the reward equivalent to what the challenge is Oh, we'll come back later. Then don't put it in early in the game. Put it later in the game. That's bad game design. That's like the definition of bad game design. Definitely didn't look right. <laughs> I missed the haiku. I don't see it. Where is their haiku? Whoever did a haiku, please repost it. I didn't see it. Darren says they're trying to basically pull a Metroidvania, show you what you can do later. Then then do it later. I'm sorry. I don't want to see something now be teased. And you can't do it. And you do it. Oh, her horrible reward. Fuck you. Make it worth my while or don't put it in the game at all. I pulled the shield out of his hand and he, d and he lost it. Throw me Stimpy. Feeling great. What's this? Shortcut unlocked? Where? Up? A shortcut. Up? I guess so. I guess this is a way down faster. Alright, whatever. What's going on? Why am I invisible? The fuck? I don't even get it. What just happened? So I'm not supposed to go down? Am I supposed to go this way? <laughs> Wait! This guy wasn't even here before! This giant enemy wasn't even here! just born. Oh, I see. He didn't exist until seconds ago. Then he spawned in. Right. Oh, my God. Oh yeah, yeah. I guess we're going this way. What's in the cave, then? This is where we're supposed to go, so what's in the cave? Hunter pants. Oh, yeah. Yeah.
The pants crashed the game. The hunter pants crashed the game. Oh my god. The hunter pants. Oh my god. The hunter pants. Hunter fucking pants crashed the fucking game, you fucking piece of fucking shit. Good lord. Hunter pants. Hunter pants. You've got to be kidding me. I received a dollar tip from Mr. Burns. That was a great fight, Mr. Burnell. I'm looking forward to a next 2v1 fight later in the game. I'm sure you are, Mr. Burns. You're probably... You probably got your fingers. You're going like this, right? As you're saying, as you're typing this. And you probably are ready to unleash the hounds. You son of a bitch. Well, thank you for the dollar tip, Mr. Burns. Oh, my God. The Wait! Wait, what? I'm back here? It saved nothing. It literally saved nothing. The game crashed and saved nothing. You've got to be kidding me. Here we go. It saved fucking nothing. I gotta do the whole fucking thing from the start because of Hunter Pants. E Ray should be out here somewhere. Only way forward is to cut through. You catch that too, BD? I'm not alone out here. Looks like it's oh my god, it's Hunter Pants! Good to go, BD. Let's try that again. So there was nothing else down here. This was a dead end. So it's not like I missed any items or anything here. This is just scenery. We're supposed to go up this way. Come on, buddy. Hunter pants. Now you see why I don't wear pants, says Mello. I, that's a good reason. I would say that's a pretty damn good reason. If you're going to play a video game that's going to crash your fucking game, then fucking go commando, man. Bloom Kid did a super chat. It'd be nice if the game is sensitive. It crashes itself if you don't tell how pretty it is constantly. Wow. Thank you, Bloom Kid. Who knew? That Jedi survivors could be oh so sensitive. <laughs> oh my god, this fucking game, dude. This is something this else. Yeah. Darren says on Grandmaster difficulty, See, those things can fucking hit you with one hit. Those birds, they insta kill you. <laughs> this game is just sounding better and better the more I hear about it. Tell you guys I don't think they saw us. Let's move. I just love redoing entire sections of the game with no auto saving during them because the game crashed because I grabbed a pant. Fucking Hunter Pants! Hunter Pants! I need to clear my. Oh, there was a meditation spot in here that I had missed. I didn't even know this was here. So this is what I was supposed to do. This saves your game, right? Back to it. All right. Raiders don't like the imps any more than we do. Wait a minute, I did. I thought I had, uh. No, I guess I didn't. I guess I didn't hit it. I didn't do this before, this item here. I missed it. 
Generations of Raka raised their young here. Then the Empire tore through, shot and trampled anything that got in their way. on the ground you got your pants on the ground flying all around hunted pants on the ground game's gonna crash fucking game's gonna crash <laughs> Jedi murderer. Are you guys ready for the hunter Don't pants? Line, Here they come. Here they come. Hunter pants. Here we go. Crash the game. No? Oh. The hunter pants didn't crash the game this time. I'm so disappointed. I wanted the game to crash with the hunter pants. Oops. <laughs> that was funny. Where am I going now? Oh my god. Game of something else. Where do I go now? Uh. Uh. Fuck. Ah. Grab the vines. Guys, we've got about 40 minutes left on the stream, just so everyone knows. If you're interested, if you could support the stream, that would be absolutely amazing. I hope you've enjoyed today's stream of Frog Hunter... Hunter Pants... Frog Hunter Hunter Pants Crasher. That's what the game should be called. And uh, if you could support it now, it would be great, because this is my only stream of the day. There's no late stream tonight. I have to do Patreon Private Reacts. So if you could support this stream, that would be absolutely amazing. And you have about 40 minutes to do it. Thank you so much. I mean, we're so close to the hat goal. It would be great to have a hat for the last half hour if we could do that. Uh, easy, easy. I'm not looking for trouble. Hello. Can I pet? Oh, you Don't can worry. pet the cute creature. Look at that. That's cute. That makes it all worthwhile, right? Playing with the cute creatures. Now, what the hell do you want? Don't worry. I'm a friend. Oh, mother of moons, that's a relief. I'm useless in a fight. Oh, never mind. You can stay here then. That incredible High Republic structure. Didn't expect to have to fight off beasts with my field journal. Sorry, rambling. Bad habit. D I'm Toa, by the way. I'm Cal. This is BD1. Listen, the Empire is not going to be happy to find you out here. Why don't you head back to the Reach? I think I will take you up on that. So she's probably going to join you, right? Join your crew at the bar. Probably. Can I talk to her again? You get a good look at that structure? Only enough to see there's no way I'm getting inside. But we're lucky. It looks intact. Wait a minute. If I'm right, it's been out here for centuries. No fucking Maybe way. You better luck than I did. It's right up ahead. Guys. Thanks for the tip. That's Tali's voice actress. That's fucking Tali from Mass Effect. That is absolutely her. What's the best place to get a drink in the Reach? I hear Pailoon Saloon is the spot to beat. I was afraid you'd say that. One day, someone will open up another campaign. That's her. That's absolutely her. She changed her voice a little bit. That is Tali from fucking Mass Effect, dude. One million percent. And she's going to be part of your crew at your bar, I guess. I wonder if there'll be missions and stuff you do with her. One million percent. Jade says, I'm loving this now. I'm not getting sick. I'm glad to hear that, Jade. The frame rate isn't completely steady, but it does sound like it is solidifying a bit in certain parts here. 
That is pretty damn cool. Tali from Mass Effect is in the game. All right, so now what we've done is we've looped, as you can see. So we can go back here and we can we can sit down and then we can continue on. So let's meditate, right? That is one million percent her. I can't. If that's her, not her, I'd be completely shocked. That sounds like her to a T. To center myself. I know. I played Mass Effect four zillion times, so I know. Okay. <laughs> Romance? <laughs> Romance Ogdo Bogdo? Sounds like a plan. That's what they were shooting at? A spy droid. Someone else has eyes out here. Maybe the Raiders? Oh shit, I don't want to... Oh. Looks like you need to force pull. Yep, there's enemies there. But the question is, am I going up or down? Does it matter which way I go here? Those two frogs were husband and wife protecting their young. No, one said it was spawn. One said it was uh, spawn of Ogdo, so one was the sun. Don't say that. I'm not ready for An item. Jam, did you see that? It bounced off all of them. What does the Empire want with a backwater planet like Kobo? Time to slice. Crew cut. We every time we have a new thing, we have to equip it. So we gotta do the crew cut now. There we go. Crew cut with a full beard. <laughs> Perfect. John, thank you. John says he rewound the stream and saw my victory. He wanted to congratulate me. Well, thank you. We have another one of those things down there. We could go down there if we want, but the question is like, what's the way we're supposed to be going? Rumor. What the fuck is a rumor? What's up here? Do we miss anything up here? I want to make sure I didn't miss anything. There's like different ways to go. Like up here there's a bridge, see? What the fuck is this? Let's try not to end up with that guy. The big boy. What is that now? Examine. Oh fucking shit! The hell are you? Oh! Ah! Hit me. That must be another one of those High Republic chambers. He's gonna stand there? He's literally just gonna stand there and do nothing? Look at this! Look at this great AI! Look at this! What a vicious creature! What a horrible, risky brute! Ha! And now I just stand here. Alright, so in the meantime, I just received a $15 tip. I'm serious, I'm gonna call out this tip, I don't care. I got a $15 tip from Darren. You're a glutton for punishment, but it was fun seeing you overcome that struggle and win, good job. Thank you very much, Darren. I appreciate the very generous tip. And with that tip indeed, we will hit our $100 goal of tips for the day. So thank you so much. That means that we'll have a silly hat. I mean, I'm not doing anything else. I might as well go get the hat too. This guy doesn't seem like he's gonna move because the AI is so bad in this game. So, uh, let me go ahead and get the hat. Now, the thing is, we have half an hour. Do you guys really want to do a quick poll? Or do you want me to grab a hat? You know what? I'm just going to grab a hat. It's going to take too long to do a poll. This guy is literally just fucking standing there. Look, he doesn't even do anything. What a great, what a great fucking, what a great game, huh? <laughs> Unreal. Unfucking real Now I'm knocking over my artwork. Look at this. I'm knocking over my goddamn artwork.
Let's do straw hat. We haven't done the straw hat in a while. Here we go. Fight him head on. Oh, I'm going to fight him head on. Don't worry. You ready? Watch this. Ready? Fucking shit! Ah! Ah! <laughs> oh, fuck this. What a piece of shit. All right. Oh, my God. I remind you of your grandma in this hat. I'm, I'm glad. She was a great woman. She was an amazing woman, and she should be remembered. So I'm very glad to be to give you this tribute to your grandmother. Oh. I chopped his fucking arm off. Say I got my revenge on him this time. Chopped his arm right the fuck off. That's pretty brutal, man. Boy. Oh wait, you gotta scan him, right? What the hell's his name? What's this? Mogu. It was a Mogu. You remind me of a mo that I once goo. <laughs> yes, Usher. I remember that fucking song. That shit was way overplayed back in the day. Player death. Oh, I didn't get my ship back, did I? I didn't get my stuff back. Oops. You remind me of a mo that I once goo. See its face whenever I look at you. Oh, it's kind of fucked up, actually. Oh, look what I just got. Is this a, is a healing? Dude, this is healing. This is tremendous. Tremendous! Absolutely tremendous. An extra healing item. Hell yeah. Estes flask, baby. Estes flask obtained. That was worth it. What the? I still have the man bun. Where's my crew cut? Well, fuck this. Who cut? Fuckers. They give me back the man bun. It's unacceptable. So now, wait, is that all that there is? Now you go up here. See, I don't even know which way to go. Is this the right way? I guess not. This might be optional. No, and this is where we're supposed to go. So then where the hell were we going earlier? Remember all that other shit that we found over here? What's all this? Can we go over there and do it? You remind me of a mo that I once go. When the Suikoden Collection comes out, will you be playing one and two both? I want to play one of them. I'll obviously play one first. Obviously, I would like to play the second one, but I doubt we're going to be playing them back to back. So maybe we'll do one and then come back to it later and play two. But, uh, dude, so recently I started hearing this that, that sound that soundtrack Ray's again. Close. Just a forest full of beasts and Imperials to get through first. Oh. So maybe I maybe this is optional up here then. All right, let's go up here first. Then this might be optional up here. Um. So uh. But yeah, I started hearing the soundtrack to him. I was like, dude, I love the music of Sweet It In. It sounds so fucking cool. Like dun 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 dun. So good, and there's so many good songs in that fucking game. Forces with me. I agree, they're kind of like forgotten gems, like no one really talks about them, but man do I love those games. 
I went and rented it, and I loved it so much, I, I went and bought it. And that's a rarity. Like, back in the day, I would usually rent a game and, and just play it a bunch of times. But that was a game I liked it so much, I went and bought it afterward. Oh, shit. So is this where we're supposed to go? I think it is. Right? Look. No, maybe not. Maybe this is optional? I think this is optional, what we're doing. So let's check it out. This is interesting, but I don't know where the hell we're going here. You remind me of a mo. Then I once goo. Don't think we can slice well, that. Fuck you! I come all the way up here and tell me I can't do it. Just fucking do it. Don't be in a wimp. Was I supposed to do like an amazing double air jump air dash onto that platform for an item too? Probably, right? Probably. I don't have it yet, so I can't do that. So where the hell does this go? There's nothing behind it, right? What's this? Interact. Can't use this lift. Yet. Oh come on! That's what I come here for? Goldfish says he got scared. He was playing Metal Gear Solid One when he was a kid, and uh, Psycho Mantis read your memory card, and he said to him, "Oh, you like Suikoden, huh?" And it freaked him out. That's actually kind of funny. You like Suikoden? Is it Suikoden or Suikoden? How do you pronounce it? Does anyone know? I think it's Suikoden, but I, I might be mispronouncing it. Oh yes, I did it! Oh, good shit. Just an optional uh, upgrade item. Yep. Looks like a data disc. No, a data disc. What do you do with this? The fuck is this? Continue exploring the galaxy to discover the treasure and who finds it valuable. I found a data disc. One of sixty sticks found. There's sixty of those fucking things. Ah. Well, at least I got it. Sixty of those stupid things. Oh my god, That's, that Usher song was so overplayed. I particularly remember exactly when it was. It was when I was going to B5. This was before Evo even existed. There was a, a tournament in California called the B Series, and B5 was the last one in that series, and I attended it with a bunch of other guys from Connecticut. And that Usher song was played non-fucking-stop during our trip. Like, literally, it was like one of the, the two or three songs. The other one was... Uh, H to the is O, E to the his A, that's the anthem, get your damn hands up. That one, that, so those two songs were the only two fucking songs on the radio. It was absolutely insane. Like, dude, is there no other fucking music? I have to fight this guy again? Oh, shit. Slap the shit on That's the anthem. Get your damn hands up. J to the his O, E to the his A. Woohoo! What do you say, buddy? Up for a little detour? What's this? I don't know what this is. Something optional? A rumor. This is the optional rumor. The fuck is that? I love investigating rumors that are actually, like, Fortresses and tombs. I heard a rumor on the internet, and now I'm going to investigate it. Darren said this is a Zelda shrine. Good. I hope it has those those gravity and uh, and ball push and pulling puzzles. Those are my favorites. Welcome, Jedi. The free. Chamber of Reason. Oh, we're gonna have some the problems here. I don't. I'm not. I don't listen to reason. Visible to us. Only through patience. Careful thought and the wisdom of the Listen to what she's saying. This is just stupid. Wisdom being careful thought? I'm not going to do any of that. I'm just going to shove balls around. You see? I'm just going to have balls going everywhere. That's the anthem. Get your damn hands up. So, I guess I could have went the other way, but I fucked it up already. What the hell's that? 
second ball. I love balls! So what happened now that I did bowl? Nothing? My balls! Oh! Oh, I saved the balls. I saved the balls. So now you probably grab this ball. You probably bring that ball across and you put it into another another hole. Put the balls in the hole, right? Has the performance improved, asked Mark? Eh. Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. It keeps dipping, but I'm just not paying attention to it anymore. I think we need this. I think we need this ball. What does this say? So... They believe something is behind the abyss. That's right. A planet. Well, I hope it's Wait, where'd my ball go? My ball disappeared. Oh, come on. My balls are gone. I need a ball now, too, and the ball's gone. What did they do with my ball? They took my fucking ball. I gotta go get my ball back. Not good. Not good. It's not good to lose a ball. You always need to have a full set. There we go. Immortals Phoenix Rising Jedi Edition? Oh yeah, it's kind of similar to those puzzles, isn't it? I would say you're correct in that assessment. It's pretty similar. Balls! I like big balls. You like big balls. Balls! I guess I should try crossing both and see which leads to what, right? Because there's two different ways to go. Because I honestly don't know which way is going to lead to what. Maybe one leads to something I need, and the other one leads to something else I need, right? There's also this. I don't know what the point of this is. Hopefully this is not one way if I do this. He would hope not. I mean... what's in? Let's see what's in here. Oh, this is a shortcut back. Oh. oh, I didn't know that. The biggest balls of them all. Because I had come here, I wouldn't have had a ball. So I wouldn't have been able to cross with no ball. I see. So what? which way is which? Is it, okay, go here, but I think I need a ball. I need a ball to do that. How do I get a ball? I need to get a ball. So it looks like I need the wall run there, go up there. Maybe I can get a ball from up there and put it over here. Right? What can I do? Huh. What if I do this? Now, wait a minute! Mm, it's kind of weird. I need, no, I need a ball. See, if I had a ball, I could make a bridge, but I don't have a ball. I had a ball. There's something else over there for a ball. I don't have a ball. See the ball? I don't have the ball for the ball. Can I grab the ball from down there? No, I can't grab the ball. It's too low. What about... Nah, that ball's too far. Hands off those faraway balls. Only touch balls that are close to you. Never try to reach faraway balls. Remember that. What the fuck is this? Why is this blocked? There's a chest in there. How the fuck do I get in here? There's a chest in there. I'm getting very upset. There's balls everywhere. So, I can't grab the ball from where I am. I need to have a ball with me in order to do this. See that? So, I need a ball. Can I get a ball from over there? Oh, you could steal a ball. I stole a ball. So now, what happens if I do this? What is this? A memory. Okay, it's an optional item. Let me grab it. A sense echo. Okay. A dead end. Uh, what's the point of this? 
Okay. No. That no, was pretty pointless. I can't figure this out. Jade says you would like to see Cody as Street Fighter 6 DLC. Yeah, that would be neat. I'd like him to play a little like old school Cody, like Street Fighter Alpha 3, though, rather than like uh, modern Cody. I didn't like Cody in Street Fighter 5. So that's going to allow me to cross over here now. See that? That's good. I don't know what's over there, though. But this doesn't allow me to get to the item that's on the other side. There's an item on the other side of the wall there. There's also an area over here. I have no clue how to reach this. It looks like you do this from the other end, the other side. So maybe we go this way. Let's look. Each echo gives you XP anyway. Darren says the echoes give you XP, so don't worry. You know, you're going to get use out of them anyway. Okay. So even if they're not too interesting, uh, you still get something. So that's the room with the chest in it. How the fuck do I get to it? Uh, another sense echo. My Padawan is impatient. That's the anthem. Get Weren't your damn once. hands up. The question is. Now I'm not gonna get that song out of my head. How will we overcome it? God damn it. It's gonna be stuck in my head all day. Yeah, I'm not sure. Do you think I could grab the ball and throw the ball in here and it would land and open the gate? What do you think about that? Do you think that's possible? To grab this ball and try to throw it in the hole? But if I grab this ball, I lose my platform. And there's no other place I can grab another ball from, right? That ball's on the other side. That's too far to grab. And there's no ball down here. I already removed the ball from there. Yeah, I don't know. It seems like that you could do it. Like, it's elaborate. You're supposed to throw it in there to land and open the door from the other side. But my question is, how do I get back here then? I might get stuck, right? Wait a minute. Can I get up there anyway? By wall running? Maybe I can get up there anyway by wall running. Shit! Fucking b balls! Yeah, but it opened it from here! Oh, shit! It opened it from there instead of the other way. Oh, good, it opened it here, too. Never mind. Excellent. My balls. That was perfect, top, perfectly aimed balls. Diligence emitter. Cool. All right, so now we can grab this. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, huh. Well, I'm in trouble now. I'm also wondering, is there a way, if I threw the ball over there, maybe I can do something here too, right? Okay, let's try this then. Okay. Oh! Oh, look at that! 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 Oh, look at that!
look at that. Oh, look what I found. Oh, <laughs> oh, I'm such a good Jedi. Oh my God, I'm such a good Jedi. Look at that. Rumor completed. That was the rumor. Is that all that's in here then? Is there nothing else in here? What was on the other side that I didn't do? Because it was the... the pl I didn't go high up over there. Is there nothing over there? Am I just supposed to leave now? Maybe? I'm not sure. Right? Like, what was over here? Anything? It's hard to tell. It looks like maybe no. Right? I think that might have been... Oh, I'll see you tomorrow, Willow. Sounds good. That was the main thing to give. There might be other trinkets in there. I made it the short way intended was to get both balls over. Oh, I apparently did it a fast way. Well, fuck the balls then. I guess we're done. We're good. I got a, I got an item. I got a lightsaber piece and I got a uh, whatever diligence. I don't even know what diligence is. What is that? Did it do anything for me? Did it give me upgrades or something? I don't even know what it was. But if we did it, we did it. I guess we're done. All right. Has Burger King responded to me yet? Sadly, no, Aisha. It's been almost two years, and I'm just thinking maybe tomorrow they're going to respond about that chicken sandwich that they don't even sell anymore. Darn. Okay. So that's where we were going to go. We had killed those guys, and I stopped going that way to go up here and explore all this optional stuff. So I guess that's it. We've done all the optional stuff now. Sadly, they're not just going to let me drop down, which would have been ideal. They're going to make me actually fight these guys. There's a big dude down there. All right. We got about 10, 15 minutes left on the stream, everyone. Thank you for being a great audience. Thanks for putting up with me fighting those two frogs. Hopefully, you're enjoying the actual game now that we've gotten to it. Um, I guess I do have to drop down. There's no quick way down from here, huh? That kind of sucks. Achievement! They never saw it coming! Do, do. Wow, they really will not let me use this ability. Hold on. can't use it! Take him out. I really can't use it. I'm trying, and they won't let me use the ability. I give up. All I want to do is pinball these guys around. They won't let me use the fucking thing. This one? I already killed a bunch. I don't know if I want to kill them all. It's kind of messed up, no? Look what I found. There was a secret one in the dark. Slice it. Diligence. Excellent. Pommel. I'm getting uh, some new lightsaber sets here. Can I sneak by this guy without waking him up? That would be amazing. Bile Maw Pool. As you can see, we have uh, stalactites and stalagmites. Perhaps I could throw this at it if I wanted, but can I just ignore it? Like, I don't want to kill it if I don't have to. What's the point? It's asleep. There's no reason to awaken it, right? It's fine. 
Oh, he's ready to go, huh? Oh, shit. I can't move! I'm stuck against the fucking thing! Seriously? They stuck me against it. I missed completely. To do that, but it looks like this is what you're supposed to do, right? Like they're kind of forcing you. Yeah, look. They're forcing you to pull and like climb across the two to get up there. I think that's where you're supposed to go. There's a new save point up there, too. Let's make sure we didn't miss anything over here, like this asshole. A shard. Let's trade it at Doma Shop. Yep, another Priorite shard. I hear okay. you, BD. Let's see. Woo! All right. We have no healing left, by the way, so we better do this platforming and not die and get to the save point. Beautiful. Oh my god, the frame rate. Jeez, you see that? Dude, it fucking went crazy bad. Oh my lord, this game. Don't know what that stuff is, but definitely doesn't look safe. The fuck is that? God, what is it? It killed uh, a stormtrooper here. Look. It's like purple shit. What's this? Oh, this is where we already were. Okay. Wait a minute. There was a secret area. I can see it. You can see there was a secret cave I missed. Oh, no, it wasn't. That was the, uh... Those are the things I just pulled. The platforms. Never mind. So I guess we gotta stay away from the blue shit. Looks like it ate the stormtrooper. Hopefully there's a save point, because I'm about out of time. Oh, what the fuck is this now? Hard to breathe. Fuck. Are there places I can go where I won't get affected by it? Let me go around, maybe. I think you're supposed to go around. See this? I see. Oh, shit. I'm guessing Z might know about A second data disc. That's two data discs. So I wonder what the blue shit is. Is it organic? Is it, is it, you know, it's weird. Some weird stuff. Huh. Can we go up? Oh shit! Oh no! No, get up there! No! Don't do da! Why they gotta fucking have me do this now when I have to find a save point to adjourn my stream before the time is up? Like, this is ridiculous. I just need to find a save point. We're done for the day, and I can't fucking find one, of course. I know Xbox has quick resume, but I don't want to leave it on fucking suspend for several days and shit, you know, and hope what the power goes out. Wait, did it say scan? Scan. It's going to scan it? This substance has anything to do with the array. Kobo dust. That's what it's called? Kobo dust? Huh. Dust of what? What did it used to be? Made 
headed to the array. It looks like we got a save point directly ahead. The rest of story is true. The key to Tantalor should be around here somewhere. Nice. I don't even know what that optional item was in that rumor area. So this looks like it's interesting to explore. We got some stuff to climb over there. What appears to be some kind of blue uh, growth there that probably we have to find a way to remove. Save two different directions. Interesting. Well, let's save, and next time around, we'll continue from here. Forest Array. Nicely done. Well, guys, today was an interesting stream. We had to fight off two fucking mutant toad frog things. Took almost two hours. We did was two hours. We got it done. And then we kind of turboed through a bunch of content here to try to get some stuff done. Next time around, which will be Tuesday, I will be doing, obviously, major progress here. It will not be me um, dicking around with any optional boss fights, right? So that's good. And uh, Kobodos is asbestos. Oh, that's just what they call it, huh? All right, so guys, I would like to say thank you. This, again, this was my only stream of the day. So I appreciate those of you who came out, chilled, and did support the stream. Tomorrow we're back to double stream days. But I appreciate you guys chilling with me for Star Wars. I hope you had a good time. And, uh, you know, next time around in a couple days, we'll continue on with this dungeon, the Forest Array. Thank you very much. See you then.